devices. Now, back to the breaking news. In Sims, a shoplifter dead, shot and killed by a Mobile County deputy. The sheriff's office says Bernie Wade Johnson had a claw hammer and tried to attack the deputy. News 5's Amber Grigley is at the Walmart in Sims where this took place. Well, Pete, such a bizarre scene this afternoon at the Walmart here in Sims. Now, I did speak with Captain Paul Birch with Mobile County Sheriff's Office, and he tells me that killing someone is the last thing they want to do. But when the accused shoplifter tried to attack the deputy, he left them no other option. I walked out of the bathroom and all of a sudden we see all this commotion going on. A disturbing scene for Christine Landers to witness while she was enjoying lunch at a nearby restaurant as various law enforcement agencies packed the parking lot of a Walmart in Sims. Captain Paul Birch with the Mobile County Sheriff's Office says they received a call about a shoplifter. Once the call went out, there was a deputy in the parking lot by chance. He observed the suspect coming across the parking lot. Birch says the deputy approached the suspect, and that's when everything took a bad turn. The suspect was not compliant and argumentative. The deputy uh, pulled his taser, and before he could deploy the taser, the suspect drew a claw hammer, began advancing on him. Birch says the deputy repeated commands for the suspect to drop the hammer, but he refused to do so, making a threat that quickly ended his life. He shot him one time. During that exchange, uh, there are a number of witnesses who heard the suspect loudly stating, you're going to kill me or I'm going to kill you. Lander says she has never witnessed anything like this. While fighting back tears, she says the deputy did what he had to do. He did to protect himself. He had no choice. He had no recourse. He did what he had to do. Captain Birch says there will be an internal investigation just to make sure that all policies were done correctly. Coming up at 6, you will hear more from witnesses about what happened here this afternoon. But for now in Sims, I'm Amber Grigley, WKRG News 5. And again, to uh, wrap up this incident, we are told by deputies that the shoplifter stole about $1,200 worth of electronics. Deputies were called. The suspect would not cooperate, and that caused the deputy to pull out his taser. The suspect then came at the deputy with a claw hammer, prompting the shooting. Again, all of this according to the Mobile County Sheriff's Office. News 5 sent out this.